With a special session on the horizon to address ongoing issues in property insurance market, we look into what's driving your rates up. 10 Tampa Bay's Brenda Parnell spoke to an insurance expert about how the cost of lawsuits against insurers is actually trickling down to you. It's a system that can allow attorneys to make bank. And Mark Freelander from the Insurance Information Institute says you're paying for it. But there is a small select group of attorneys that is crossing the line. Freelander says Florida has a unique system where if someone files a lawsuit for a claim against a property insurance company, the insurance company has to pay for the opposing team's attorney, whether they win or lose. Costs that eventually make their way to your rates. Whether you are one of the policyholders that has sued your insurer, doesn't matter. You are going to pay for litigation. Freelander tells us some attorneys take advantage of this system by taking on just about every case they come across because they know they'll get paid either way. An insurance company was sued over 87 cents because the claim payment was calculated wrong. So instead of settling it in a proper manner, the trial attorneys filed suit against this insurance company and racked up thousands and thousands. Freelander says there are also problems with scheming contractors driving up your costs. He says they'll tell you something is wrong with your home, ask you to sign paperwork, and... And they could file a suit on your behalf without your consent. There's already been chatter from legislators about ways to remedy these issues in a special session slated to start on Monday. But Freelander says we'll just have to watch and wait to see what lawmakers decide. Until then... Every consumer in Florida is paying for these lawsuits. Miranda Parnell, 10 Tampa Bay. Looking at the cost of litigation in the property insurance industry is at the top of the agenda for lawmakers in the special session, along with addressing issues with reinsurance in the state. Again, that will start next Monday and run until Friday.